Hey guys, what's up? I Sack the Tron here from One Hive Gazette here with my next video. And in this one, I'm going to be showing the uh, three attacks on my base in the last war and kind of how their plan was tweaked. Um, basically, how they got the three star. Um, I know you guys are waiting for a recap video, and uh, I'm in the process of making one. The only problem is uh, the clan we just warred, they got matched up uh, right after the next, the next war they were in is now with a, another elite war clan and they don't want to have to change all the bases so they asked um, us not to post any attacks on YouTube until this war's done so I'm gonna record the recaps but I can't upload them till Tuesday I want to respect uh, dark looters I don't want to show their bases and all where all the traps are and stuff because uh, the clan that's facing them now could see the video and uh, their bases could be out so I don't want to um, do that to them so I uh, and anyway, I'm gonna I'm gonna, show, I'm gonna make this video just to uh, to give you guys something uh, for today because I don't want to leave you guys with nothing. But like I said, I can't up upload recaps until Tuesday, so just how it works out. So I apologize for that, but there's not much I can really do about it. Um, anyway, though, uh, the first attacker was Flokila. He doesn't know where any of my traps are, um, and he's coming in with a Go Vaho. So uh, we'll fast forward to when he starts and. Yeah, coming in with golems at the bottom here. Uh, Wizards just creating a nice little funnel. Uh, then there's a wall breaker in in just a moment. Has the queen. So, no queen walk is a pretty standard go ho. Uh, golems re out on in. Drops a few more wizards. So, going pretty heavy on wizards. And here come the Valks. Um, all my single bombs are right there. So, it does get a few of his wizards damaged. But, no big deal, really. Uh, drops the jump spell down. Out come my CC troops. And the whole point of having all those little troops and then the, uh, the witch is to get people to drop that poison spell early and then they'll miss the witch so the goblins run out and you drop down the goblins and you miss the witch so that bought me a little bit of time but the witch eventually does go down even though she's not in the poison uh, everything's taking the jump and moving into the core you can see my double set of bombs has been triggered I still have two more singles though uh, there pops my Tesla farm over there uh, it's doing some pretty solid damage Drops that second jump to let everything get into my queen. Um, I think his king does take the jump and does take out my queen. But you can see he has no spells left. Coming in with some surgical hogs, but he's hitting a lot of spring traps on the right side. Um, deploying the rest of these uh, hogs. But I still have a lot of defenses up. And uh, the expo didn't go down. It's starting to take out some of his wizards. You can see it hits, they hit the single giant bomb. And then uh, these last few hogs are going to get eaten up by the Teslas. Uh, so he kind of peters out towards the end. I don't believe he triggered my other single bomb, so he, that's kind of still a mystery for the next attack or where it is. Um, it turns out being right next to where the queen is, um, where it just went down by the uh, mortar in that compartment on the left side. Uh, but he doesn't know that, so you can see his last few troops making their way around the wizard on the town hall and the king still up, but uh, still quite a few defenses that he didn't take out. Uh, so a pretty solid attack for a first one, just couldn't quite get it done, didn't have the... Uh, the heal spells he needed and he hit a lot of my spring traps so um, anyway we're gonna fast forward through this as uh, this wizard takes out a few more buildings and then the king goes down and that's gonna do it for time all right um, now I'm gonna take a look at the next attack on me and uh, I guess spoiler alert we lost I'm not gonna try to splice this in or anything uh, but I'll, I'll talk about the war more in the recap I don't want to go into details now it was a fun war though that's all I'm gonna say for right now uh, but anyway, this next attacker, um, and I think someone in the comments was saying uh, how one of my bases was really easy to hit with a uh, dragon attack. And uh, that is a new strategy. If you can basically zap quake one of the air defenses like that, then come in with the queen and some healers and take out two more, and then come in with a king and take out the third one, uh, or the last one, that can work. So all four air defenses go down. Then you use dragons on the queen side. Um, so this is what uh, Leon's trying to do here. So makes a funnel with some minions. I uh, already made the funnel on his left for when the king's ready to go. But drops the queen down first. Wall breakers to let everything on in. Um, they bust in right there. And then the queen's going to make her way up. Now I put the king there to try to defend against this. I also put my skelly traps there. Just to try to take out any type of queen walk that tries to enter in right here and get both my air defenses. Uh, but he does, has the, he does have the poison. And um, he's going to be able to pretty easily take out the king and the skelly traps make him drop the rage there's a lot of point defense and plus all the uh, defensive troops uh, coming at the queen now uh, but he drops the poison down and that really slows down uh, any defensive efforts the king's already down and then here the minions the archer or the uh, goblins 
and the witch go down pretty quickly as well. So his queen's going to step up in just a moment here. Another skelly trap pops, uh, but she's going to take it out. Uh, you can see that first air defense about to go down, and there it goes. And then she's going to step up and take out the second one in just a moment. Right there, she locks onto the second one. Now here comes the golem and the king. I He might not have needed the uh, golem. Maybe a few giants would have worked, because I think the 30 troop space just cost him too much. Um, he's just trying to get in there and take out that air defense, so it's like the second or third building the king targets. So there's no there's no point of bringing a golem. A few giants would have done the job, but you know not not that big of a deal. It was only wasting a little bit of troop space, and the Tesla does pop, so quite a bit of damage in that area. So I guess, I guess it made sense, but I don't know. Maybe could have done it with less troops. King takes out that air defense, so all four air defenses are down. The queen is still up, uh, but she's taking a lot of damage. He has to pop the ability. Here come the dragons at the top. Uh, creating a little bit of a funnel there before his main group of dragons comes in. And uh, I think he should have dropped his dragons at the top instead of the left side because they get locked onto the town hall and a few of them wrap around the base. So that hurts him. You can see the queen's engaging right here. Uh, but one dragon under rage takes her out pretty quickly. Um, trap is popping. It's not going to do that much damage. The Tesla farm took out the king and the golem. And they're also going to take out these balloons he tries to sneak in. The queen is still at full health in the top right, so she's an issue. The sweeper's pushing back the healers, but nothing's targeting her, so it doesn't matter. But like I said, those two dragons are kind of wrapped around the base, and uh, it's up to kind of one dragon and one balloon to take on the Tesla farm, and also the archer tower, the expo. Um, still quite a lot a lot of uh, def air targeting defenses on the bottom left here. That's kind of how I designed my base on purpose, because I, I, I was suspecting that someone would try this uh, to enter in with the queen there, and try to get those two air defenses. So I did what I could to defend against it, and I guess it was enough on this attack because uh, all four of those defenses are going to take down the dragon. And then even though the queen still has her healers, she's going to take a lot of damage right here, and uh, she's going to go down. So yeah, fast forward, and uh, I think maybe ran out of time. I'm not sure. But anyway, uh, that's Leon's attack, 82%. So they're getting close, and let's take a look at the final attack that finally uh, took out my base. We can just go down right here. I'm number 19. So, I mean, three attacks, that's pretty solid for me. Um, obviously, all Town Hall 9s will be three star in a war like this. It's just a matter of how many times you, how many attacks you eat up before they have to. It takes away scout attacks for the Town Hall 10s and stuff. So, um, I'll take the three attacks. More pe Some people would like five or six, which is crazy. Uh, so, very good job to those guys. Now, I'll give them a shout out in the recap uh, when I talk about the war a little bit more. But for this, for this video, let's focus on uh, the attacks on my base. Um, taking a look at Bronx, and he's coming in with a go Vaho again, except he's coming from the right side here, so switching it up a little bit. I guess he didn't like the dragon attack plan. He liked the first attacker's uh, army comp a little bit better. So comes in with another double jump uh, go Vaho, drops the jump, the first jump spell down with the Valks and the King. The wizard's creating a funnel, the minions on the mortar, which is real nice. Um, quite a bit of point defense up, up top there, so his troops are taking a bit of damage. Uh, the queen's getting flanked a little bit, but um, has the poison spell for the CC troops and then the heal. Has to pop the queen's ability right here because she's taking a lot of damage, but she gets these uh, defenses taken out, and the uh, troops keep moving forward. Has the a next, next jump spell uh, to let everything on into the queen compartment. Uh, here's where I think he got a little bit lucky. He never triggered the double set of giant bombs right there between the uh, Tesla and the air defense uh, by that wall. So... I mean, he has one heal spell, uh, maybe 20 hogs, and then has quite a, a few bombs to contend with. Has the single at the bottom there, and then has the double set. So I thought um, he was pretty much finished right here, uh, but comes in with some back-end hogs. And you can see right here the pathing. Uh, maybe it's luck, maybe it was planned, but a uh, few hogs hit the single bomb. No big deal there. And then a golemite actually walks over along with a hog and triggers... Uh, the double set, so um, maybe got a little bit lucky on the pathing. It seemed like the hogs were just so spread out that no no bombs could really do any damage because it only would affect a few of them. So I, I guess I guess that might have been part of the plan, just to spread everything out, coming with some back end hogs, and just uh, not put all his eggs in one basket, so to speak. And it worked out very nicely. He has still a bunch of hogs left up, and uh, king at full health, the queen, some valks, and then the cleanup wizard. So a nice attack to Bronx. Um, but I'll take it for sure with three attacks on my base. Um, but yeah, that's going to do it for this video. I'm sorry. Uh, I got put in a bit of a, t a difficult situation uh, for making a video today just because I couldn't show any of our attacks on their bases. 
and I didn't want to show any attacks on the other guys' bases in case they want to reuse that base or, you know, do a variation of it, something similar. So I uh, kind of had my base to work with um, because I could, obviously I can give myself permission to use my, my base because I'll be changing it for the next range to war. But anyway, that's going to do it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed uh, the attacks you saw. Doing my best here. And uh, like I said, I'll start recording those recaps for Tuesday. Uh, so stay tuned. I'll have a lot of coverage. And I might even use the attacks for other videos if I can. Uh, but yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys later. Bye, Sectatron out.